Well, Courtney, if you need evidence that this flu season has been concerning, we learned this afternoon that Carolina East Medical Center is bringing back their masking requirements for staff and visitors to their New Bern Hospital. The move comes as data released this afternoon from state health officials show dozens of flu deaths since last week, and that is why health officials are urging those who haven't to still go get your flu shot. New numbers from the State Department of Health and Human Services show 43 new flu deaths this week. This brings the state's flu death toll to 95. The head pharmacist at Farmville Drugs, Stacy Garner, says some people wait until the last bit of the season for a reason. Patients want to wait this late just because they think that it's going to cover them longer. Um, I don't really think that's necessarily the case. I think between as long as you get your vaccine between October, um, December, January, you're good. According to ECU Health, there has been 218 cases of positive flu tests in the past week in both their clinics and the medical center. Although flu cases are still prominent, hospital admissions are going down, and the state is seeing that trend too. Luann Wiley has been giving flu shots for about 38 years. She says this flu season has been more active than others, making vaccinations more important. I haven't gotten it, get it, you know, because it's not too late to get it. Um, and if you're over 65, you really need to think about getting your flu vaccine. A CDC report shows that vaccinations were lowest this season compared to the past five years, which could be a reason for the spike in flu cases. Health officials also say COVID-19 vaccines are important to get, which could be administered with the flu vaccine. The nearest place to get both vaccines can be found on vaccinefinder.org. Live in studio, Ho Jung Roo, WITN News. All right, thanks, Ho Jung. And despite the high amount of flu cases, the flu death toll of 95 cases this season remains lower than last season's total of 196 cases. Typically, the flu season runs from October to May with peak activity between December and February.